Hello, and welcome back to another episode of House Flipper. We're picking up right where we left off from last episode, so let's get into it. Laser tag in a bunker. Okay. Alrighty. Alright, so let's do this one from Mr. Steve Marner. Another bunker job. Hello. We bought a house with a hidden post-war bunker. The previous owner didn't appreciate what he had and made it a storage room. We care about safety. And the weather in this part of the country gives us some concern. We have renovated the house. But as for the bunker, we want to have it done by a professional. Can we count on you equipping it appropriately? If a tornado or something even worse, nuclear bombs, total atomic annihilation, hostile mutants, etc., would hit, we want to have a safe place where we could stay for several weeks until it is safe again. Like a vault from that company. Vault Tech? Anyway, best regards, Steve. All right, so we've got a house with a bunker, and they want to turn it into a vault. Got it. All right, Steve, we'll help you out. All right. Oh, fix up his little garden area. Getting all the weeds taken care of. I don't have to do this. I choose to do this because it's nice. Oh, get rid of these guys. And hopefully we can find them where the bunker's at. There it is. We found it. All right. I'm going to just take a peek inside. See what the inside looks like. Oh, nice. Nice and cozy. I don't like the bathroom tile. Like that room's nice. But that's a big bedroom. Oh, anyway. I'm just being nosy. Anyway, that's not what we're here for. We're here for the bunker. Okay. Not bad. Oh. Oh. Why would you have the bathroom right there? Oh, God. That sink is disgusting. All right, let's get rid of the trash. Get rid of the trash. Um, does the light switch work? There it goes. Oh, I see, that's where the power should be, at the entrance. All right, if this is this bad. Okay, that's weird. A lot of cobwebs. Just go in and get rid of all the trash first. They want us to sell that too. Okay. They want us to sell that. Okay. I'm gonna sell that. And dispose of that. And we're gonna sell that too. Okay. Ooh. Ew. Lights. This one's a lot better than the uh, the other one that we just did. Open the doors that way. Woo! He wanted to take flight like a Repcon man. Right, and they want us to sell this too? Oh. I guess not. This is another disgusting room. All right. All these beer bottles, man.
Alright. I think that's everything. Sold. Where does this go? In their bedroom. <laughs> Neat. Uh, that's funny. Alright. Just want to make sure we got all of the trash. Oh, they want us to sell these. Okay. That's fine. Alright. We're going to clean. These little stains by the stairs are really hard to get. You have to be at like a, you have to back up from them in order to get them properly. Most of it. I don't know where all the rest of the dirt is. Might need to turn on the mitt to figure it out. But we'll get all the rest of this obvious dirt. This room's clean. Let's clean this one. Scrub a dub dub. Make sure the walls are clean. No more cobwebs. All right. And then this room. That one's clean, that one's clean, that one's clean, that one's clean. This one, still have dirt somewhere. It's like a little meckle of dirt. Eh. And, where the heck is it? Oh, I don't know where it is. It's the problem with finding these, like, 2%, 1% things of dirt. It's like really hard to actually see without using the map, mini map. So we're gonna turn that on. Settings, gameplay, mini map, mini map, right there. And I have that feature, so it's over here. There it is. I don't like playing with the mini map on, but gameplay. All right. So we're gonna get some. A large can of paint. They want us painting there. There and there. And this one. I, of course, placed it right in the way. Oh, not paint. They want us to use ceramic tiles. Okay. Whoa. Okay. So I think you're supposed to come in through this way. Through the bedroom. Not through the bathroom. But it's a good way to... Um, Egress, but not ingress. So, okay. So we're gonna start with the entryway and paint. I actually think I have a perk point that I can do for painting. 25% past their paint. So we also got this one, 25%, 50%. Uh, I don't know how to plaster yet, so I'll save that one. Um, Building distance, one meter more. 25 extra job payment. Oh, we'll do the um, nice X. This old farmer. Architect. How do I? Oh, that's kind of cool. That's really cool. I'll do the plastering. All right, I haven't even locked a good mop yet. How do I do that? Oh, I need more trash. Okay, anyway, let's paint the walls. Nice white color. There we 
we are. That looks way better. I mean, granted, this kind of does look like a, um, a bunker from Fallout. Totally. Especially with the, the concrete, like, tattered concrete look. So. Oh, I gotta go back. So. Got some paint left over. Nice. So we'll move that to our next room. Oh, I don't know why I grabbed that. That's what I need. I'll paint this. So it only opens one way. So we're going to paint that. That's not what I wanted to paint. There we go. Might have actually bought too much paint right now. Get this wall. Yeah, we might have actually bought too much paint. It's okay. I'd rather have too much than not enough, right? This will be in our way. So we're gonna move this to the other room. Move that. Okay. All right, so this one, we're gonna to have to go in between the shelves. Normally I would just move them out of the way, but we're in a tight, cramped area. And I'm well aware that I can get the perk that oops, I got a paint. Okay, that makes you not use paint on the wall. Um, after I do all the quick jobs, I'll do that because sometimes the game, you, like you paint a wall and it doesn't quite register that it's fully painted. It's like there's it'd be 99% painted and not 100%. I've had it happen when doing quick jobs. So, and I'd rather avoid that if I can, so. All right. So that way, that's why you see me go over the walls again. Just that way it's 100% painted. There's no questions about it. Like I'll take a little bit of extra time, throw a little bit of extra paint on there. Some of my money back. Not gonna be a full refund. Nice. What I'm gonna do, the game doesn't really make you do this at all, but before I put tiling up, is this bugs me. So just like in real life, 
you would paint the wall, or at least fix it up, repair it, and then you would paint it. So that's what I'm going to do. Or paint it and then tile it. So that's what we're going to do here. Totally don't have to. This is 100% absolutely unnecessary, but it's aesthetically pleasing to me. So that's why we're doing it. Besides, we painted the entire rest of the bunker. Might as well get the vault all matching. Plus, and it kind of definitely highlight where the uh, where we're placing everything. All right. All right. Besides, we had the extra paint, so might as well, right? Okay, so now we're going to do wall tiles, the ceramic gray. Not bad. So, do tiling, grab all 15. All you're going to do above the door first. There we go. And we're going to need more. So, I want. I grab two more stacks. Make that three more stacks. <laughs> We're going to go through a lot of these. I may not need a two or three stacks, but I'd rather be safe than sorry. Yeah, we definitely needed it. Yep. I was right. Okay. We didn't need the full amount, but we still needed three stacks. There we go. Place these, sell them. I don't like it when the walls are just one color, like or one um, tile pattern like this. I prefer like a what is it called? Waste cutting um, walls, but it's not bad. I mean, it's not horrible. I do like the nice pattern of the tile. It's just really repetitive, but it is what it is. So. Water heater, we're gonna do that over here. We're gonna get these guys, so, okay. Okay. Uh, those are already unscrewed. We need to unscrew this. I don't like the metal floor either. Oh well. Toilet, we're gonna do, we're gonna do this again. Except we're gonna do a white. No, I definitely like the black. Black with the uh, white. Uh, you know what, we're gonna make it comfortable. We're gonna make it comfortable for them. Um, so we'll do a nice toilet. Uh, let's see, what do we got? We could do that one. It's pretty interesting. Like a light gray. No, I'll do white. And metal will be sunny yellow. Interesting. Where's the metal? Oh, that's the metal. We do golden metal, red, white steel. Nah. Black steel. Hmm. Do sunny yellow. 
Let's see how that looks. So. It's not bad. So that's where the toilet will go. We'll get a nice sink. Let's see. What kind of sink? Well, that's interesting. Um, hate it that does that. What kind of sink do I want to go with? I kind of like this style. Can't really do, I don't want wood though. So, do I have one like that that is not wood? I'm curious, what does this look like? I could do sunny yellow or golden. That's really cool. Tabletop, snowy, cream, marble, and do cream. And the wood, I don't want to do wood. So definitely don't want to do that. Let's see, what do we want? Oh, we already did the toilet. I don't know why I'm looking at toilets. Sink. I want something small, but also really nice, you know? Do that one. That one's too big. Yeah. Beige. Uh, let's see. I kind of like this one, the the one with the bowl, but that was not bad either. Eh, I kind of like the bowl one. Eh, the bowl's too fancy. Okay, so that's the toilet we went with. So, uh, let's look at kind. I mean, that's really fancy. I think I'm going to go with this, that golden, and then we'll do a uh, let's see. I don't like the grit. It's too marble. I don't want the marble. I like it. I like the design of it. I just don't like the marble. It doesn't fit. I think I might just go with uh, this one. White sink. Do like a gray, beige, grassy, now uh, coffee. Beige might be okay. Pastel rose, I'll do the gray. So that's where it's supposed to go. So I do the gray. It's kind of boring in here, but whatever. And then for the shower, we'll do a nicer shower. We could do something like that. That would be kind of cool. But no. Uh, let's see. Can you just do that one? That one's only a little bit more. Do that and then do a black. It's not bad. And it'll fit right in that corner. Yeah. We'll do that. Okay, so toilet first. Well, that's kind of cool. Nice. Nice. Now the sink.
There we go. Didn't even make a mess that time. All right, and then this guy. Perfect. Not bad. I like it. All right. So they want a chest. So we went with a gray. I'll do a black. Black. Doesn't look too bad. Black chest. So then we need a paper towel holder. We're going to do silver. Actually, new. No. We're going to do this golden. Ooh, that looks nice right there. And paper towel, because you always need paper towel. So. And I want four things of paper towel. Only four. Trying to open that side. Wouldn't that be? We're gonna give them more paper towel because if uh, the pandemic taught us anything, is how precious paper towel is during a total atomic annihilation or anything that makes people freak out. All right, that way they're nice, fully stocked on TP. Come on, let me close it. There we go. All right, that one's done. They want a bed with a drawer. Oh, that's not bad. Walnut, do beach. That's not bad either. Uh, American elm, blackwood, cedar. I'll do cedar. Drawer will be cedar as well. And bedding will do the green. That right there, and oh, there's two of them. Okay, so that one will be. We'll do the same thing, cedar, except we're gonna do this one. Put that there. Make sure that's up against the wall. Again, and shelf hanging up. We got pine, dark wood. We'll do green on this side. Ooh, I'm thinking right here. Yeah, go like that. Do that. And then we do blue, do pink. There we go. Can't do it there, so I have to do it on this side. There, yeah, nice, pretty, and colorful. That way it matches the bed sets. Nice. Nice. All right. So we're just buying objects. So this is a pantry. So I'm going to change this. Put that there. Yeah. Because it looks like, oh, a safe. Okay, we'll do a safe right here. A lot of other stuff here. Oh, it's a food container, okay. Jar of soup, that's what that pink stuff is. Okay. All right. He doesn't want to sell in these, so we're going to put these guys on the bottom here. Oh, that's my flashlight. Tools be on the bottom. Since I don't think it wants us selling those. Nope. Keeping those. No. Alright. So first aid kit. We're gonna put that here. Um somewhere. I'll do it right here on the bottom. Makes sense with tools. 
go to that water container. So do the water on this side. Water. I'll do the rice. I'll do that right here. Didn't like being that close, so. How much more bags of rice? One bag. So I'll do four bags of rice. And four bags of macaroni. I'll move that over onto this side. These are bigger bags. That's fine. I'll just scoot that back one. Peanut butter, we'll do that in the middle. There we are. Jar of soup, two of them. Some nuts. They kind of look like cereal, to be honest with you. All right, we're just going to stock this up. I want this to look nice and full. Pickled cucumbers, we're going to put on up here. It won't let me put it up there. I'm too short. Ah, come on, get on the safe. There we go. Ah. And just because this is bugging me. Tomatoes, food containers. So I'll give them a bunch of food containers here at the bottom. There we go. Now uh, it's just tomatoes, meat, and Do some more down here. And some can of tomatoes.
There. It's not bad. Let's see if there's anything else we can add in here. Oh, all right. That's all for this room. Now, here is the kitchen. So, we're going to need a sofa. So, this is a pretty big item. So, let's do it right here. I don't like the color. We'll do that blue. Voltec blue. I think. Okay. Let's see. Gas stove, gas cylinder, modern hanging cabinet. Okay. And a table. So the table will do black wood. Now we'll do cedar. Nice and strong. We're going to do the couch this way. I have a reason for that. Maybe not. That's a really big, big piece of furniture right there. Okay, so we're actually going to do it this way. Okay. Um, I would not put the couch in here. That's a really big couch. Hmm. All right, I'm going to start with the kitchen side. So sink. This is a, let's see, beach cedar. We're going to go cedar. And I'm going to move it to about here. There we go. For a burner gas stove, we'll put that here. Gas cylinder, we'll put it right here. Where is cedar? Do that. I don't like the white wood. Does that look good? No. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Ooh, that is really close. Um, so I did that. The front is, yeah. And then, yeah, the front was cedar. Yeah, that just looks better than the de white details. Can't do anything with that, so. So I'm actually gonna move this to the center. This in the corner. And move this over so it's centered in the room. I don't like that. All right, we're gonna move this all the way over here. Oop, that against the wall. There we go. And move the counter, the cabinet against the wall right there. That doesn't look bad. I can live with that. Put the gas burner on that side. Table. Put right there for right now. Couch. Might have to go back to where I was before. I don't know what. Let's just keep this. 
can't sell it. But can put it up here out of the way. Uh, let me up. I don't know where that went. It vanished. Oh, there it is. It popped in though. It decided to show itself. There we go. Microwave. I don't know. Table. Go right here. How many chairs? Two? Okay, I can do two. This will go against the wall. I here. Yeah, that's not bad. And then just two shelves, which I can do. I can't do it, Cedar. That's a shame. Um, uh, break up the white. Well, I could do pine. Ah, pine doesn't look too bad. So I'll do pine. And I'll do that right back here. Uh, do it off that angle. That doesn't look too bad. Um, except for that. We need a spot for that. Can't open any of these. Um, I don't know where to put the microwave. There. That's not bad. I can live with that. Plus, then you can put a trash underneath the microwave. That works. I like that. Couch is in a good spot. These are in an okay spot. Tables in an okay spot. It's not bad. Um, I'm going to move this slightly over again. Just so that way it's in line with the counter. That's better. I like that a lot better. All right, so bathrooms are good. Close the door. Bedroom is good. Turn the light off. Pantry is good. Fully stocked. And bedroom's good. Or living room, dining room's good. So we're done. Sorry about the uh, length of this. Just going back and forth. How do I get out of here? All right. So that is all done. Not bad. Not bad. 10,000. Wow. Big payday for that one. So let's see the before and after. Yeah, way nicer. Not bad. Not bad. So, that is going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me decorate and renovate these bunkers. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll sing to you, I'll sing to you.